Alrighty guys, here we go again. Two runs ago, we got the longbow. Yesterday, we got a torch. I'm a bit afraid. What will the wheel throw us today? <laughs> Only one way to find out. Let's just spin the magic wheel. Please don't be the archery great bow. That's all I'm asking. I should have clarified. Please don't be any bow. <laughs> At least it's not the R3 Great Bow. Instead, the Albinoric Bow. Another day, another bow. Bow number 9. Yeah, dropped by Albinoric Wolfpack Archers. Right, right, right. Those annoying guys. Around the Consecrated Snowfield. So it's gonna be a new game plus weapon. Okay, best drop rate is 4%. That's at least okay. Why a standard bow run. We just need to farm this weapon first. Let's fire up Elden Ring. So, if you are a new viewer, I'm doing this insane challenge where I'm trying to beat the game with every single weapon there is. The idea is that I can use only one weapon per run, but I'm not allowing myself to use any kind of mods or cheats, so I have to acquire each weapon in its natural in-game location. If I need to kill something in order to obtain the weapon, then I can use a different weapon for that purpose. But, if the weapon is only obtainable by defeating a major boss, then I'm doing the run in a new game block. Plus. Before all the new game plus runs, I sell all my items except the weapon and the armor of my choice to make it as close as possible for a standard new game run. I also randomize the weapon selection every time using my trusty magic wheel. If you like the idea and want to support the challenge, the best way is to give the video a thumbs up, drop your thoughts in the comments down below and subscribe to the channel. But now, let's get back to the video. Do we have the same file that has snowfields already unlocked? Nitro to flail definitely has. Oh, let's take Nitro to flail. Silver Scarab, yep. Oh yeah, mighty shot is the innate Ashavar. And that's just a shite Ashavar. And as I said in the beginning, sadly, there's only really one actually viable longbow Ashavar, and that is Reign of Arrows. Can you start again today? Okay, let's go maybe today. No. Okay. Bro, well, almost it was at least. These archers are going to be painted form. Possibly. Don't know if Nitro the Flail is the optimal weapon for that. Hopefully this doesn't stagger her, we might even be able to just kill him or her right here. Yep, cool. <laughs> Bye, Renala. Easy. Bye. <laughs> Some bigger that decks. A little bit endurance and then rest to arcane. Cool. And change Ritual's advertisement to Silver Scarab. I'm gonna go farming now. I wanna get the weapon. Are you ready for this first try drop? Okay. Thank you, boy. Go on. Yeah, I hate these guys, honestly. Oh, yeah, and we have heavy loaded again with the talisman. Okay. we we'll probably just force back fight, maybe. For this one time. Okay. The fuck no, the wolves. Oh, oh, wow. Is that fair? Is that fair then? I wasn't able to even get up and. Wow. He fucking kept. Yeah, I can't do anything. I can't. Yeah, sure. One hit kills Torrent. Yeah. <laughs> okay, sure. Oh, but I can't do anything! I, can't, I, literally, I literally can't do anything. That doesn't. Oh. The stationary <laughs> archers can drop it too. Can they? Drop by Albinoric Wolfpack Archers. Wolfpack Archers. But then, after that, it says one can be found riding a wolf, three can be found seated near each other. Uh, why are those three also called Albinoric Wolfpack Archers if they are not Wolfpack Archers? Okay, well, thank you, Ice Ryan. <laughs> I'll kill the stationary ones. Oh my god, why is the hitbox? Yeah, I, I think we gotta come up with actual strat here. No, I... The grace just left of the path by the big tree. There is a single archer and three small woods. Oh, there. Okay, yeah, this is probably the best, but... Basically, I'm just gonna quickly get here and... Use spinning chain. And get the weapon. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, that's the strat. 
Okay, so apparently these guys also drop the armor set. Probably you can get the whole set from Lieutenant too if you kill her. Oh, we got the chest light as well. Seems like, again, we are getting the full armor set before we get the weapon. Well, at least we get to see what it looks like. Also, Latena lives, I guess. Only missing the gauntlets. I don't know if the gauntlets are that important. Yay! There we go. Now get another one. <laughs> No. <laughs> oh, binaric bow. Actually, cool looking bow. We didn't get the bracelets. Question is, do we go murder Latena for just the bracelets? Can't kill her anymore? I'm actually not sure. Give it the frog, ma frog mask first. Maricus tits. Yeah, this is the ultimate albinoric. The albinoric queen. Next, go check Latena, I guess. Gonna get bottom of this cave, I believe. But. Okay. Moment of truth. Yep, he's. Gone. And apparently you only get summon. All science, at least. Yeah, okay. Let's get the lava tier, I guess. And go respec and then sell all our shit and then new game plus. Vigor, obviously. Some endurance. Let's go for some more vigor. Some endurance. Then just dex, I guess. Maybe some strength too. Sure. Queen bracers. I like that idea. Yeah, that's the choice of the day. Shop. Sure. Now it's selling time and then to New Game Plus finally. We have the outfit, we have the weapon. Time to start New Game Plus. Begin journey number two. One hour and 14 minutes. Well, I was expecting less than that, but it's alright. That's a nice trip. I like it. I like it a lot, actually. Okay, so what we're gonna do is the basic bow setup. The annoying thing about this bow is that it really doesn't have anything unique. Even though it's quite hard to get, there's nothing unique about it other than what it looks like. Make it have like frost build up or some unique ash of form, and it would be fine, but no. Get up, get it. Yeah, this might actually be quite fun way to do the bow run. A little different than the long bow. Just me and Latena against the world. And get the Albinoric happy ending. So yeah, it was actually a good idea because I do want something different than the long bow run because we did it literally a few days ago. And today at least we get to use frost arrows too. We normally don't get to use them in bow runs. This might be the only bow actually. <laughs> there we go, the guns are great snowfields. So what up, Topes? Plus nine. Oh my god. I did not mean to jump already. Oh, there goes Deadless. Next up, Serpent Arrows and more Aeonium Butterflies. I'm like 200 of these. At this point. Yeah, I think the next thing after this is just kill the bell bearing hunter and then craft some bleed arrows and then we are ready to fight March. Actually, never mind. Forget about Latena. How could I forget about Latena? We have again dropped on the branch, but that's fine as we learned last time. We also do this. Probably can't do that though. Need to still land on the <laughs> bottom part of the branch. Parkour! Ooh. There we go. Easy. It's not really good against Belbering Hunter, I don't think, because. He's too squishy. He's too squishy. Also, a quick the talisman, I guess. Okay. There we go. He was under control all the time. Buy bones with all my money. <laughs> Get some bleed arrows. Let's mix the physic, though. Next tier is fine. It's just green spill crystal tier, whatever. Okay. I get to fight this guy with a bow. Must be amazing. Yep. Looks like so. So don't really know your moveset. 
At least they have bleed arrows. And you're not that hard, I mean. Just stay Bloodhound Knight. Okay, that was cool. Me there, headshot, blade broke. Okay, good. Let them now. Uh, we meet again. I mean, what we could do is just murder her right here. We actually even have the summon already. Oh, we couldn't do her guest land then. Wait, we need. Oh my fucking god, yeah. We need to talk to Alibus. Is that right? Albus never gets to live. He's a this fucker. Thank you. They say. Bye. Now I have two. <laughs> that time us. Now. Let's go get March. Oh, we need the spirit calling bell. How's deathless? Oh, you piece of. NPC fights are so great. Especially with the bow. I love them. All these five fucking. Summon. Ah, <laughs> oh, thank you. Never in my life have I struggled against any shit that hard. Why are we even here? I already forgot. Alright, <laughs> spirit calling bell. <laughs> this will be a long fucking run. Let me tell you, this will be a long fucking run. Now, on the march. Finally. Don't let the struggle bother. Excellent one. Excellent one. Where do we want to spawn Latena? Somewhere where she don't get stuck. Uh, it really doesn't matter, I guess. Can I make them fight? It's a little interesting. Okay. <laughs> Just let's survive. <laughs> For a long. <laughs> For a long. Yep. Bye, Latena. Good job. Kinda of funny how bosses don't react to rain of arrows at all. Oh, well, I have mana. <laughs> it's why it was so great against Gideon as well. Didn't input read it. Dead. That was actually almost it. Oh. Uh. <laughs> actually did the trick shot, but survived. We survived. No. Let's just use our rush reach, I guess. So whatever, whatever, whatever. When do we upgrade Latin? Uh, I guess just after we're done. Because the easiest way is to get the Ghost Clover from Necron. Maybe let them survive a little longer this time. Okay. <laughs> wow. Cool. Okay. Good fight, little enough. You were very helpful. Also, I should carry more blue flags with me. Fuck, now I can't cast Rain of Arrows anymore. Can I make this fight so much longer? <laughs> For no reason. I'm actually going to use. Oh. Use my Starlight, starlight Shot here. No. 
Don't touch it, please. Oh yeah, I also forgot that it's the sneak and plus, but this fight take even longer. Honestly, I haven't really noticed the difference, weirdly. I always notice it uh, with melee weapons against Margit and Godric and Bahir. <laughs> I feel like <laughs> it's pretty much exactly the same. That's definitely not true though. Really not that easy. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Fine. <laughs> Create the weapon a bit and just run down. Plus 12. And I guess use my money. I'm actually gonna buy bones first. Got like 500. That should be enough for the rest of the run. Oh, forgot to, forgot to allocate the flask charges. Need my blue flask. For Latin and Reign of Arrows. What? How does the saying go? Third time makes the charm. Again, my reflex was to just quick travel instead of without. Would have been better. Should learn it. Should honestly learn it. Oh, I can't summon if I summon boys. Is that true? It's like some. Whatever. Why am I just standing still? To be honest, it seems like it's some try to proc the poison here. Than what it was with the long bow, so. Maybe it actually is double the resistance, I mean. No! No! Why an awkward first <laughs> phase, honestly. Nice. Blade Brook. Okay. Mm, not the best right out of fight, but <laughs> it's whatever. <laughs> This is ditch, nonetheless. Also, now we can equip third talisman, which will be Wario your shot. Let's go get some ghost clovers. Why is Mimic so tanky as well in your <laughs> campus? Oh. This will literally take forever. Okay, woo! Best number four. And goes to five. And some bigger. Okay, okay, okay. Great Latina. Oh, I need to do this shit. I haven't had the need to do this shit in a long time. You two are like literally almost next to each other. Why can't you talk to yourself? Bang! Latina to Albinoric plus five. Cool, maybe now she survives more than two hits. Okay. And DTS. Where do we put Latina now then? Here, I guess. Those trees might be blocking her at times, but it's whatever. Bang! Bang! Oh, he's already poisoned. Good. Why did she... Why did you use the lightning strike already? The hell, man. This is interesting. <laughs> Wait. Did she die? <laughs> okay, well. She really is squishy.
great fight. So amazing. A nice dodge. Quite hard to judge the other one by jumping. It's possible, but they be very precise with it. Can you just die? Please. Thank you. Bye bye. First spawn Latina somewhere. I guess. Uphill. gonna get this right. I'm gonna get this right. Need to keep the ag aggro on myself. The let up and live, I guess. He's not doing that amazing damage though. That's something I guess. It stacks up. Just the regular Lumbo Rillin. Wish there was an unique Ash of War. Something that those Wolf Riders do. Or even Barrage. Or something Frost related because the, the Albinorix have Frost related stuff. But no. A little, at least Lad and I actually. <laughs> it's kinda glitch here. Well, then I actually survived. What a fucking surprise. Actually, go Gil Giliga first. Can he summon in this fight? He can. Cool. Christ, that was close. Nice! Kinnika survived again. Ish. Queen versus queen versus queen. Yeah, exactly. That. Sure, let's do word of the day. Finnish word of the day is queen. That in Finnish is kuningatar. <laughs> Gets me every time. Every fucking time. Don't touch my queen. What the fuck? Nope. Cool. Okay, he's just dead. <laughs> Sorry, Latanam wasn't able to protect you, protect you properly. Morgoth is kind of cool fight with bow. I like it. A little bit of challenge. Fuck. Okay. Yep. Cool. Bro. Fuck you. Never stay still, down. Oh my god. That was close. Just died. 
So what we can do here is we go into first upgrade Latena plus ten. Then we are going to go kill Camera Denial, get the consecrated snowfields. Yeah, finish Latena's guest and also farm some rhymed crystal bud. Get some frost arrows. And only after that we finally go fight fire giant. Yep, plus eighteen, cool. Be hard to hit him with the rain of arrows. Hit her with the rain of arrows. Likes to move around a lot. Yep, there goes Latenda. <laughs> Sadly. Actually, just learned that I don't even need to roll. That's the sword here. I can just literally walk. Jump this. Can. I wasn't able to finish. Okay. What an exciting fight. Yay! Blah, blah, blah. Next person to join the Discord will be number 69. That's perfect. As if I had planned that. Then we get to actually also <laughs> wait for weapon number 69. Dun 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 dun, Max Verstappen. That's how easily you can get plus 10 with Ghost Spirit Ashes. He's probably still going to die quite easily there. Get the Consecrated Snowfields again. Why again have we went to Consecrated Snowfields like literally almost every single run in these past few weeks? There definitely has been less runs where we didn't go to Consecrated Snowfields. Yeah, nothing to do with chat, no, surely. Uh, we're going there to finish Latina's guest, just because why not? And also, as a secondary thing, to get some rhymed crystal bud, so that we can craft frost arrows. Okay, let's see how this goes again. No, oh, fuck off, Niall. Yeah, buff him. That's cute, actually. Oh, sorry. <laughs> So let them, I am. Forgot. Oop. Shit. Yep. You try let them. I guess this guy is quite easy with a bow, actually. Much more chill when... Keep your distance. And hard to still hit with... Rain of arrows here. Oh! How did I dodge that? Completely intentional, obviously. Cool. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Bow officially better against Nile than what Nitro the Flail. I think was the one where we actually struggled a bit. On to... On to Great Snowfields. Not to Halic Tree though. No, we are not fighting Melania with Albinoric Bow in New Game Plus. Miyazaki confirmed there's still one secret which hasn't been found. Could that be real? Watch it be this wall right here. No. Oh, Latina again. Yeah, I do hear you. <laughs> bringing you home, we're bringing you home. I don't know, I just got X. Rhymed Crystal Bud also over here. I got there's a lot of this in here. We can't even attack here, why is that? Oh, what the fuck? But we can't be attacked. Fuck's sake. Jesus. Yay, she's home. It's sad that there's no Albinoric ending. Number Dragon Smithing Stone, we do absolutely nothing with it. <laughs> Thank you, Latin. There's a shit ton of these here. What the hell? Oh, but we need the cookbook too. Fuck. Well, that's Pipedia, right? Yeah. Oh, 
Who's dying? Ah, ah, ah. Aya, aya, aya. Now we should be able to craft old bone arrows. Yep. And what we can also do is craft some rut bone arrows. Okay, on the fire giant. Finally. Oh, let's go, let's go. Where do we strategically pawn London though? That's the first question. Somewhere up hill. I don't know, just somewhere here. You're gonna just immediately die from that. Oof. No? Good. Up already. I think so. It's hard to tell because Lotan is also shooting in the. So now he's rotten. What are you actually doing? What the fuck are you actually doing? Let me go the second phase very soon. There we go. Yes, we poison first this time. Oh my god, really? That really is not consistent. Sometimes safe, but not all the time. Poison, yes. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah. Bye, Latina. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> There's nothing you can do. He goes for the fire breath. Won't even have time to use anything else than rotten poison arrows here, it seems like. Latina probably did get shot there. I think. Was very useful. Then just finish with regular arrows. Camera angle is so awkward, honestly. Open your eye. There we go. Rot plus poison was actually enough. Didn't even need to bleed a frost. Huge up from Latin as well. She survived longer than I expected. Cool. Let me craft six of these first and then let the rest of Father and Lily sleep on arrows. Yeah, six is enough. Let's poison first this time and then rot and then sleep. Good luck, Latendam. You're on your own. Now please, don't go through. Thank you. It's right, I don't even need to sleep, fatty though. Just gonna try the poison. That's fine too, I guess. Okay, cool. Poison. I'm not sure whether it's even about to go for that rot. You just sleep him and let him die. So, but he's blocking me. Yeah, 
sure. Now that you are close to each other, just do that. Cool. Right, they got raw to you. Already set you with your other arrows, I guess. Nice, nice and easy, nice and easy. Really. Cool, easy, easy first trap. Still didn't even touch the frost arrows and barely used the bleed arrows. Honestly, the rotten poison are huge alone. I guess we kind of have to use the frost arrows against some boss. Maybe against Malay uh, Malania. Maliket. We used them. It's the bubble run all over again where <laughs> I tried to say bubble but instead went for moon. Now Maliket is Malania. Malania with a bow. Honestly. <laughs> No, that's a terrible idea. But just speculating here. Theoretically, wouldn't Rain of Arrows work against Malania? For, for example, if. Oh my god. Just got <laughs> destroyed by these birds. But for example, Rain of Arrows worked very well against Gideon. Because they, uh, they can't input read it. I'd, um, it. I'd imagine Melanie also can't input read it. It could work out. I honestly think so. No, no. Oh my fucking god. Here I am talking about going to fight Melania with a bow, but I can't even handle this bird. I'm kind of tempted to <laughs> actually go try it out. And I even have the ultimate weapon to kill the archers at Ordina. I can just shoot them with their own fucking bow. I have to do that. I actually have to go do that. Plus 25, and now Malaget. She's just trying to fight the DDS, of course she is. Nice. Didn't get the frost proc there though. But they're still alive. Nice dodge ladder now. Simply duck. Overhead swing. Okay, that did hit. We will! Oof. Me and Latina against the deco. Working usually very well. Good. Nice. Latina actually survived. Didn't expect that. Then again, it's kind of easy to keep the aggro on yourself with this fight. Uh, go for my entrance. Oh. 
Here and next. I'd be interested to see whether Gideon actually dodges Latina's shots. <laughs> Please don't shoot him yet. Yeah, he kind of dodges. Sometimes, at least. Whoa, okay, okay sure. Can't handle the rapid fire. Shit. Can't tell if he's rotted or not, I don't think so. A lot of them actually solos here. <laughs> oh, wow. A rot arrows are a waste, yeah, but... It's gonna kill him with physical damage of the rot arrows, but that's fine. <laughs> The key is finally rot. Yep, there we go. Latina carried. Ish. Me and Latina against the world. Yeah, I used only 21. Rot arrows myself. Usually I need to use so many arrows in order to kill Gideon. Now, sadly, against the next fight, I can't see Latina surviving. Wait, Latina. Hold up, hold up, I'm coming. <laughs> Why is it not a cute, but... It <laughs> When I use them, I mostly don't even have time to inflict bleed or frost. Oh, there we go, finally. Because there are phase transitions that just cancel everything. And maybe she'd actually just more often go for poison or rot and then physical arrows. First Frost Brock, yeah, I think so, actually. Okay, that's not time then. Good to know. Latina has survived longer than I thought, for sure. Holy. I believe. I believe. I would have not guessed that. Latana actually survived. Ish. I was able to protect her. Let's go, Latana. It's you and me against the world. Can we get the light load, actually? Not yet. Do you know what time it is? It's electric time. I'm gonna test my theory. Yeah, how does it feel? How does it fucking feel? When someone does this to you? Huh? How others use their time to prepare for the DLCs, train for the Moog fight, try out cool builds. How I am preparing for DLCs by fighting Malania with a bow. No, not there, not there, not there. Over here. Over here. No. Shit. 
Not looking good for letting them. I'm sorry. Not easily, it seems like. At least in New Game Plus. There we go. Can't be asked to change the arrows. I'm just finishing uh, with serpent arrows. Yep. Okay. Well, um, in a way, I've started to like bow, <laughs> bow fights and bow runs. It's also satisfying to learn how to fight with a bow. Okay. Here we are. Surely. This will work. Rain of arrows will work. That is to just be a coward and do this. Wait, not that. I mean, I hit with one arrow. Need good RNG as well for this to work. Hmm, there we go. I need to have more mind. <laughs> Might actually even respect for this. <laughs> what do I do with all this vigor when I could have it on mine? There we go, Frostbrook. Yeah, the problem is I want have mana for this. But in theory this works. Let's go respec. Finally the hateless doggo. No. There we go. This is slowly moving towards the all remembrance is a run. The moon, not the moon. Oh. Stop stalling. Thank you. So, how much mine do we want? For the eight. Yep. Pretty good. Let's stay with sixty bigger, but go thirty-eight mind. There we go. We are cooking. We are cooking. Now, gotta be patient. Huge first hit though. Good iron sheep. Excellent iron sheep even. We might even be able to get the poison. Oh, the server there is just better. Or Reina for us as well. I feel like this has happened more than once that Serban there has just connect very well. And resistance is high. Also it's new game plus, so makes sense I guess. I feel like that might be it in us. There we go. Poison procked. It. Bleed, the nice. I mean, frost. Next is bleed. Feel the bleed brook. There we go. Okay. Do we even need Latenda? Should we solo her? 
I think we just try to frost and bleed her again. Okay. Fuck was that? Uh, okay, very lot in them. The thing is, she also heals when she hits Latenda, so the downside of her. But yep, there she goes. No, <laughs> okay, now this is gonna be a lot trickier because <laughs> she just starts running at me. Um, can't anymore, just outrun her. <laughs> yeah, that's a problem. That you do here is just keep on running and wait for the uh, Scarlet Aeonia. Welcome to the stream. That you found the YouTube, YouTube channel again. I'm pretty sure that was well timed. Dodge, but new. No. Okay, well, here it's. Test it. Works very well for first phase. Does not work for second phase. <laughs> and we give up just like that. Because that was not even close. Well, you can do it with Hitless. The first phase. Like that. Well, the second phase is the problem. Just so much more aggressive there. Maybe first phase, Reign of Arrows. Second phase, Barrage. Could work. We can finish the game. In the millennia of, of Latin, which is a pretty risky move. Mm, yeah, that could actually maybe work. If we could keep the aggro on ourselves and run away and let Latina shoot her. I don't know if Sabri's woo is good enough past the chest to run away. Keep the aggro though. Six, six, six. Let's go beat the shit out of Renegon and Elden Beast. This feels familiar. Wonder why. Nice. That's frost far off real quick though. Oh my god, change the arrows, please. Thank you.
Interesting. Bad. How did I fail that? Okay. To do this, me and Ladana against Elden Beast. Let's go. Which one is pursuing me? Good. I sp That reach is honestly stupid. <laughs> what the hell? How far do those arrows go? I mean, Latinus reach. He's even shooting him <laughs> mid air while he's doing the reach. Latina. The real G. And it is cheese. Thank you, Latana. She survived. She survived. Yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. Albinaric bow done. Well, that was that long run. <laughs> I really wished to <laughs> win Melania, but this thing would have been so amazing. If this strat would have worked, I can face as well. Hitless bow Melania would have made one hell of a video. <laughs> also, nice drip. I'd say S tier drip, honestly. Look at that. That's fashion. That tier list though. Where does Albinaric Bow fit? Now, better than Longbow for sure, yeah. I don't know if it actually is better than Longbow, but I enjoyed this run more than the Longbow run. I'm gonna put it here. The D tier, it still goes. Yeah, even higher than Beast, Rebel and Torch because of how unbelievably annoying it was to fight Gideon with it. And that's about it for today's run. You know the drill, if you enjoyed the run and want to support the channel, then please hit the like button and some comment down below. It really does help you the algorithm to share the videos with others as well. And if you don't want to miss future content like this, then I recommend hitting the subscribe button and follow button on Twitch as well. But thanks again for watching and I will see you in the next video with the next weapon. Until then, it is good. Bye.